Hello, this is uh, Bonsai Anonymous, and I'm going to try my best to keep out of this video. Uh, it's very, very hot out here. Okay, so this is a willow that I've been looking at for a while that's needing some help. First of all, it's way too tall. So the first thing I'm going to do is, before I even get to that, I'm going to get to these dead spots and just get rid of them. Now, how do I know they're dead? Well, if they have nothing on them, like this, not a thing, chances are good. And then when you clip them, you see there wasn't anything. Okay, that one's gone. I'm going to take him down to here. I don't know about you, but one thing I really don't like is when scissors pinch your finger. That I just hate that. And that's what these are doing. Okay, now, let's see here. Instead, anything else here? This little piece can go. These, are, these scissors aren't so good. Um, they weren't expensive. I have some slightly better ones coming. Slightly better. All right, so now we're down to getting rid of the dead stuff, and we're going to go up here and clip off some of the tallest ones. Now, I'm not clipping them back all the way to where I clipped them before. All right, now, let me get rid of another plant. This really doesn't need to be here. It's kind of big, too, and it's been here a while. Bye-bye. Okay, so now let me tell you about this. Let me tell you about this uh, pot. I made the pot, and um, it's, it's, it was a, it's kind of a trick pot. Now, before I go any farther, I'm taking these out because they're in the way of the trunk. I need to see the trunks, okay? And, and I am cultivating this, uh, I'm not cultivating this, that's, I don't know, but cultivating the uh, uh, artillery fern, that's what these are, artillery ferns. Okay, so this pot, I made it a long time ago, um, and it's, it has in it my teacher's um, bonsai soil, okay? And I glued some of it to the edge so that the theory was that it would look like the bonsai soil went right to the edge of the pot. And, and it, it does that, except, of course, now the, the way I glued it is, I, know, I now know it's not gonna work. It's, it's hot glue and that doesn't work for that. Okay, so let's continue here. Um, at a certain point, I'm going to not necessarily in this case, but uh, at a certain point, I'm going to start incorporating um, this plant in my uh, in my designs. Okay? Uh, but no matter how I use it, I still can't let it uh, get in the way of the trunk. All right, so I'm going to go over here now. Let me, let me look at something here. Over here we have some that aren't in the way of a trunk. And, and uh, I'm going to take the ones that are out. That, maybe. That. Okay. I think maybe that one too. All right. So besides the, besides the use of his... Um, bonsai soil, we're supposed to have a path in the middle, okay? So, I think these rocks at one point were in the middle, uh, making a path. So I'm gonna just scoot them over. I, I remember liking it as saying, oh, that's not too bad. Uh, but as far as what actually it was, I can't tell you, I don't know. Um, all right, so, All right, so I got rid of some of the uh, artillery plant. I'm going to also cut some of this off when I find it, if I can. This rubber. Uh, 
it, it's not a great idea and it, it it doesn't it doesn't didn't age well either so where I see it I'm going to try to get rid of it like that there's some and and the pot is just fine without it, it doesn't, doesn't need to be there it didn't need to be there all right so I'm mumbling that's okay you got to get used to that if you watch my stuff I talk to myself when the camera's not running so why would I stop when it is all right so we, I think I have the path here, where, kind of where it was, and I'm going to make this a little bush by the path rather than a big one, okay? So this stuff is very forgiving, and I think you can, you can really just about put, uh, put it like a hedge. So I'm, what I'm doing is getting all the branches down so that there aren't these little peg branches coming out. All right, so now, there's the path, goes through there. I can maybe make it even clearer. And at the end, in the end, I can certainly go get some more of these rocks. They're everywhere. But let's see if we can make use the ones that are here. Okay. All right, so, hello. All right, so now we have this path. And now we have to decide about where the front of the tree is. <laughs> First of all, let's do a few things. This one, while somewhat, is that a tree? I think it's a tree. So we're going to leave it. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven trees. How fortunate. We, for some reason, the uh, odd number is preferred. Okay. So, um, all right. Let's think of where the front is. And I think I'm going to I had to make it right here. It's, this is one of those cases where I don't really know what I was thinking when I did this, because it's so long ago. And I just, I just noticed very recently how leggy it was getting. All right, and I know I'm going to have to go back farther than that. But let me see how these do. Now, why do I have to go back farther? It's because the trees are way too tall for this trees could probably be that tall and I think I cut them off at that point a long time ago and then just kind of forgot about the tree so anyway there's a lot of other things I can I can do with this but I'm gonna leave it like this and um, not wiring it I'm not sure that wiring is what I want to do well, this, little, this is a tree and this is a tree so one thing we are gonna do for sure when these if they fill out, I hope they do, <clears throat> is make them a little more upright. I mean, they can be crooked down here, but when they come up, usually they go straight, okay? I don't know what this plant is. After, after we stop here, I might use my little phone deal to determine what it is. Okay, so we got a lot of this stuff out of here, and, and I'm not going to uh, what, what's the word? I'm not going to um, propagate from this pile. I'm going to give it to the turtles. They they love this stuff. And I didn't feed them today yet, so this will be nice food for them. Okay, anyway, enough rambling, enough BS. Uh, this is Bonsai Anonymous out.